Hey guys and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be reviewing some new update secrets that I don't believe a lot of people know about. But before we get into them, of course, if you haven't already, make sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and smash that like button. Also, make sure to check out the new limited edition Halloween merch, which goes off sale on November 1st, so make sure to act fast and get it while you still can. Anyways, today we have actually 9 new secrets to review. This is probably the most secrets I've ever had for a secrets video like this, so yeah, it's cool. We have some pretty cool things, so let's actually waste no more time and get right into today's video. Number 1, we have the bunny's house returning and guess what you can actually enter the house or haunted house technically i call it the bunny's house but a lot of people do call it the haunted house so over here we have the bunny's house or haunted house before we go into the house let's move on to secret two which is a new version of a house this is a house we've never gotten in the game before it's a completely new house i have no idea if this is a sneak peek to a possible new house being added to greenville who knows, it could be. But I thought I'd include it because it is kind of secret because we don't have this house in Greenville, so I might as well include it. But it could also not be added because it's basically designed like a haunted house, but you could take all the Halloween decorations off and call it a regular house, I guess. What are you staring at? Moving back on to secret one, we can actually enter the bunny's house or haunted house. And also be aware, there are jump scares with the specific house which was actually not available last year. So if you just walk through one of these rooms or just simply down the hallway, I think like right over here, oh, right there. They think they can scare me. They think they can scare me, imagine. Yeah. Anyways, this house is of course designed like a haunted house and to be honest, it's pretty cool. And this will actually only be here for Halloween. So most likely it will be removed probably November 2nd, November 1st, something right there. For the next couple of weeks, this is actually going to be my house. Let me know if you guys want a house tour. Now moving on to secret number three. Do you wish you could still capture ghosts after the Halloween event? Well, guess what? You can. You can capture ghosts even after completing the event. Of course, for fun, you cannot earn extra cash. Also, it must be night for the ghost to actually appear, but you can actually just take this out and just capture ghosts. Which is actually pretty cool, so, so if you enjoyed the 2023 Halloween event and still want to capture a ghost, well, you still can. For fun, of course. Anyways, let's move on to the next thing. We have two new buildings near the graveyard. So over at the graveyard, we have two new buildings on the map. Right here. Of course, not including the haunted house. Anyways, let's move on to our next secret feature. This is actually on the new Halloween event vehicle. There are actually two secret features on the specific car, and here is how to use them. Alrighty, so the first secret feature is lights. So by simply clicking the F button, I'm not 100% sure if this is available on mobile, but it is available on PC. So if you click the F key, the lights will enable. And if you're wondering how to turn on the sirens, press the R key. <laughs> Also, I thought I'd add this, but there is a spotlight by clicking the J key. So if you do want to enable the spotlight, all you have to do is click the J key. And now the spotlight is enabled. Now moving on to our next secret feature, we have two new settings available in the settings menu. Let's check them out. So under the Halloween category in the options menu, we now have Halloween effects and old school lighting. Halloween effects basically gives you these type of effects. And old school lighting, if you enable it, gives you an old school lighting vibe. And here it is. This will only be available for Halloween, so make sure to try it out while you still can. To be honest, it'd be pretty cool if they actually kept this, even after Halloween. It'd be cool. Now moving on to our next secret feature. This is actually at the clock tower. So every hour at the clock tower, the bell rings, and here is how it sounds. Moving on to our next secret feature, there is a new job alert on screen now. That's actually been appearing so much recently. Right now, of course, it's not popping up, but I'll show you a clip on screen of this actually popping up. I believe when I recorded the Halloween event review video, that popped up at least 
20 times. So I'm surprised it's actually not popping up right now, so yeah. Oh, there it is. Open the job menu to get paid. You may want to consider opening the job menu to get a paycheck. So that is actually the new job alerts, which is kind of annoying. Now moving on to our potential secret change. This is not really a big one, but I thought I'd include it. But houses now have Halloween decor. So if you actually spawn or claim the house here, we actually have Halloween decor available at houses. Which, of course, will be removed after the Halloween season. And certain houses actually have pretty good Halloween decor, so make sure to experience with this and see which house actually has the better Halloween decor. Anyways, let's move on to our final secret change. So over at the billboard near the Cenex, there is a new secret. Wow, there's a lot of fog. Before we go ahead and review the secret feature, I do want to give out huge credit to Raz. Of course, I'll have his link in the description down below if you do want to check out his specific video, but he did include this. So I thought I'd include it, because why not? So over here on the billboard at the Cenex, there is a new secret change. You can already see it from here. So right here on the billboard, we actually have two figures. So near the Senex or next stop, we have two new figures on the billboard, which is actually pretty cool. Of course, credit to Roz. Anyways, that's basically all the secret changes that I have for you. Of course, let me know in the comment section down below if I did miss any. I tried my best with this, but there wasn't a lot of secret changes, but I believe 9 is actually quite a bit of secret changes, so yeah. Anyways, of course, if you haven't already, make sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and smash that like button. Also, make sure to check out my limited edition Halloween merch, which is only available until November 1st. Link in the description down below. Anyways, that's really about it. Hope you guys enjoy, and thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Staring at.